Here we go. Ooh, gonna be some sun in my face. We'll see how that plays out. gonna wreak havoc on the footage too I think. Yeah we'll see. Ooh, chunky. Ooh, tight turns. Ooh, yeah. So I'm not real familiar with this por oh, portion of the trail. And sun glare is posing a bit of a problem on my glasses. <clears throat> can't see anything <laughs> all right so this is the part that I usually ride from right here that first part was pretty sick smooth and flowy just got to get a feel for it looks like people bail there This gets a little rocky right here. You're in kind of a river bottom. And so you gotta <clears throat> negotiate these rocks. <sighs> okay. I used to send that area a little faster. But it seemed like every time I was getting a pinch flat or a flat. There's another little techie spot coming up. <sighs> There's a drop I've yet to take. It's right up here. Whew. 
So right here is an area that if you go around that side, I always go this way because it just looks more inviting, but if you go this way, there's this drop right here. I don't like it because I don't like the rocks in the landing. And then you got to turn right there. I mean, probably not a big deal if this was trimmed back, I think it'd be a lot more manageable. One of these days I'll bring some trimmers. So instead you go over this right here, which is all sharp rocks. I think the other way is actually to get rid of some of those little rocks down there, trim back the bush. You're golden. Uh, yeah. All right, let's get back up to speed. River crossing. <laughs> And that's it for the first leg. Whew, yeah. Now, it's funny, every time I take my wife on this section, she freaks out. It is kind of skinny. And the pipe is a little slippery. So, you gotta kind of dodge things. Water break. What you're seeing here on the map, the straight lines represent paved roads that you can ride, and then the squiggly line is the dirt road. And on the right-hand side, where it says start downhill Feldmeyer number 330, um, that's where you can jump on there. You can actually go up a little further, closer to Goldwater Lake, and but it's kind of flat from Goldwater Lake, or actually below Goldwater Lake, to where I have the circle marked for start. That's all kind of flat, So, but you can ride it. It's, it's still good riding and it's fun. But this trail is good for all skill levels. Um, the better of a rider you are, the, the faster and the harder you can send this trail. But I've taken beginners on it. I've taken my wife on it. Um, if you're gonna ride it hard, I do recommend maybe wearing some pads. Uh, there are some areas where the rocks are pretty gnarly and uh, you don't want to hit them. So if you look at the map that I kind of squiggled together here, really the most fun way to do this is to park your car down by the White Spar campground and then you can take the paved road uh, back towards Prescott and then and that's kind of downhill towards Hazley Road there then you take Hazley Road and start heading I guess it would be east and Hazley Road is the toughest part that is a pretty steep paved road takes you all the way up to the Senator Highway then you get on the Senator Highway and start heading back uh, south again and you just follow it all the way up until you get to the sign and just past that there's a parking area and that's where you can turn in and off to the right is a little tiny trail and that's what will dump you onto the uh, Feldmeyer number 330.